Oh, okay. What have we got here? I decided to, uh, purchase a hospital in this terrible, terrible time of the COVID-19 or coronavirus. <laughs> We're all dying.
Alright, I'm not going to mess with that right now. I don't have to mess with that. Okay, there. Oh. Freezing it up. Remove. Yes. We're going to remove that. Alright, let's uh, start this new game. At Two Point Hospital, over 52% of our patients believe they leave healthier than when they arrived. Our precisely calibrated equipment is operated by compassionate healthcare practitioners. Ah. Who have even been to medical school or watched ER. If you suffer from turtle head, let us ease your worries and noggin gently out of your body. Just infection is no laughing matter. Put your trust and oversized shoes in our capable hands. We're building a brighter, safer future, and hardly anything will stand in our way. You deserve the best. So join us at Two Point Hospital. We're open for new staff, new patients, and a new you. Can I go play golf yet? I'm teeing off at three. <coughs> Excuse me. Interesting intro. Very lively, very fun. Let's see uh, what kind of trouble I can get in owning my own hospital. Welcome to Two Point County. I'm Albert Crank. I'll be your trusty advisor on this journey. Wow, good timing. This is Hogsport, and here's your first hospital. Select it and press A to get started. Alright. Uh, begin your career... As a hospital administrator, learn the basics of the job by establishing your first hospital. Fantastic! Uh, two point foundation, value $200,000, 10,000 shares, $20 a share. I guess that would make it $200,000, wouldn't it? Begin your career as a hospital administrator. Learn the basics of the job by establishing your first hospital. Welcome to Port. Welcome to Two Point County. Are you ready to start building your first hospital and curing some patients? Okay. Looking around the hospital, first things first. You'll probably want to have a look around. To move around the hospital, use the left stick to pan the camera. Zoom in and out using the right trigger and left trigger buttons. Rotate and pinch the camera with the right stick. Wow. Intuitive. Alright, move the camera. Uh, the first thing the hospital will need is a reception. Patients will head here when they arrive at the hospital. Let's build a reception desk near the entrance. Okay. Okay. Uh, press X to access the menu at the bottom left corner of the screen, then you use the down and the D-pad to navigate to the items option and press A to select reception. Alright, um, <clears throat> items, a thousand dollars, I guess if it's necessary. Alright, maybe. Uh, Hmm, interesting. Hello, welcome to Tip Hog Sport Whatever Hospital. I uh, will put it there. Yay! What a fine hospital you have. Great! We'll need an assistant to run reception. Let's hire one now. Open the hire menu and select assistance to view job applications. I have to hire people now? I didn't expect to do that. Select hire, then navigate the assistance tab. Alright, let's look at some applicants. Uh, Millie Boohorn. Employment reference. Charming. Metaphysically disgruntled. Recruitment fee, $850. Oh, what? 
the better they are, the more expensive they are. Ooh. Let's see. Uh, Madeline Rake. Employment reference. Nasty. She's a nasty girl. The girl next door. Even better! She's the nasty girl, and she's the girl next door. Their compliments sound fake. Hmm. Henrietta Squirm. Funny. More bacon than eggs. Oops, I got a crying baby. One moment. This is Ricky Hawthorne, bringing talk, music, and news to the whole of Two Point County. And if you're listening to us from the newly opened hospital, just turn up that volume, because nothing drowns out the sound of sick people like the voice of a world-class DJ. Coming up next, 42 hours of music from the background band. Enjoy! I like how she upsets other people, but she's a heartthrob and the target of unrequited idolization. I'm gonna go with this one. Is lit up? Hmm, it's not. That power's not on. That's important. I got stuff charging over here. Gotta make sure my power's on. All right, job applications, then hire option. But wait, oh, here we go. Uh, woo! Woo! All right, off you go. General practitioner's office, great. Before we officially open, we'll need a GP's office. Hmm. Patients will visit a doctor working as a general practitioner at each stage of diagnosis. The GP will assess patients and decide if they are ready for the treatment, or if they require further diagnosis. Let's build a GP's office now. I gotta keep an eye out for my baby. He's got the flu. He's been grumpy. He's recovering from the flu. He's almost he's almost done. <coughs> <coughs> to build a room, press X to access the menu in the bottom left corner of the screen, then select rooms and use the up and down buttons on the D-pad to pick one from the list. With a room selected, hold A and move the left stick to drag her out of floor plan of the appropriate size. All right. Jeez, 
Is she British? I think so. All right, so we're gonna build a GP office. Uh, let's start over here in the corner. Wait. Ow! Okay. Apparently that's not right. So we gotta press and hold. Minimum size three by three. Well, is there any difference if I make it bigger? You know, I've been humming that tune to myself all week, which is uncanny because I've never heard it before. Or have I? Oh well, more catchy music coming right up. Oh, weird. Uh, we'll put a door here, and we'll put a desk. All right. Wait, what? Oh, okay. So we got a chair. <laughs> and with the filing cabinet right here. Uh. All right. GP's office. Doctor whom? Excellent. Now we'll need a doctor to run the GP's office. Hire one now. Okay. Henrietta Squirm. Funny. More bacon than eggs. Wait, isn't that the other? Oh, these are the assistants. Burp. Doctors. Benji Pigmento. Employment reference. Will work for peanuts. Short temper. Inspiring. Cherishes pie. Reduced salary expectations. Short temper becomes nasty when unhappy. Inspiring. Inspires other people. Class clown. Criminally under seasons. Huh? Everything always. Entertainer. Entertains people with their sweet dance moves. Hmm. One's really cheap. One gets angry? Hmm. Well, let's see, we're about to get some new people to uh, apply here in a second. So let's see what happens. Nah. Alright. Here you go, Dr. Guy. Oh, I totally have that backwards. I knew it. Good news! Our hospital is now open for business. Patients are starting to arrive. After they register reception, they'll be sent to the GP for diagnosis. Alright, does that matter? You can quickly pause and resume time in the hospital. Pick up. Rotate, rotate. There we go. You, sir. Get back in the room. Get in here. Get at your desk. Rude ass. Is she asleep? What? Oh my gosh, she was asleep. What am I paying you for? Millie Boohorn? Conditions at the Rotting Hill Hospital are getting worse every day. Apparently, patients are just as. We've diagnosed our first patient. The GP has sent you a message. Shut up, music guy. We've diagnosed our first patient. The GP has sent you a message. Have a look at the message list in the bottom right. Looks like we'll need to build a pharmacy to treat the patients. We'll give them drugs. Fantastic. <clears throat> Alright. Why? Get patient. Pharmacy required. A doctor have discovered a new illness. Grout. Grout is frequently transmitted in bathrooms and modern medicine. Modern medication is effective, unlike earlier times when it had to be dug out painfully with a screwdriver. The patient? Are these bathrooms? Get the patient to wait, and then I'm gonna build a room. We're gonna build a pharmacy. We'll build it out here in the corner. Yeah, there we go. We'll give it a door over here. Um, what is that? 
Oh, it's a dispenser. Interesting. Interesting. Very interesting. Alright, so we'll put that down there. Hello, everyone. How are you? I'm sure everyone is doing just lovely. Alright. Minimum room size. Uh, Alright, so we're done building the pharmacy. We'll give them their drugs. Now I have to hire a nurse. Uh, so we have two nurses, both with one-star ratings. One's more expensive. Short temper becomes nasty when happy. Makes people laugh. Well, of course I'm going to go with that one. Here. Uh, you work here. Good. Good deal. Now give people the drugs they request. Let's see. Uh. Uh, okay, so now they're queuing up. They're getting their drugs. What is it? What does this work? It's like a shake machine. Ooh, medicine of the future. Just took her drugs right there. Give them at a hospital achievement. Cure one patient. Lovely. Patient cured. Well done. We've cured our first patient. We've earned some money, and the hospital's reputation has improved, which will attract more patients. When a doctor or nurse treats a patient, their ability will influence the chance of success. Some illnesses are tougher than others. Continue diagnosing and treating patients to keep the money coming in so we can expand the hospital. You know what that means? Sell them more drugs, and we make more money. Drugs is money. Alright, so next we need to tell everybody that a pandemic is spreading, like corona, and they'll come flooding in like droves. <coughs> now that we've got some expensive machinery, we should think about looking after it. Machines will deteriorate with use and will need repairing. Alright, so I need to hire some, some laborers. Hire a janitor. Assistance, janitors, maintenance, repair. I guess I'll do this one since this person has the most qualifications. What I'm gonna look for. I'm gonna look for qualified people. Well, I have a message. Okay, cool. Um, place two extinguishers. So we need to make sure that we're safe. What the fuck? I'm gonna put one here. I'm gonna put one over here. And then I'm gonna delete this one. Sell it. There you go. Keeping people happy. So we'll need to kind of give them a waiting room, essentially, is what I'm doing. So let's go to items. So we need two benches. A bench. We'll put a bench here against the wall. And a bench here against the wall. And we want one leaflet stand. Here, we'll put it over here so they can read it. Here's some literature for you fools. Place one drink machine. Drink, 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 drink. Ah, drink machine. Yeah. And then one snack machine. We'll put it right next to the drink machine. I'm good at this. If you want to pick up an item, highlight it with the cursor and hold A. No, I'm good. I'm good, man. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Staff energy and break. Staff get tired as they work. We'll eventually go on break. A staff room will help them relax and return work energized drinks and snacks. They'll keep them happy too. If you make a room larger and fill with interesting items, it will be considered more prestigious. People using a high prestige room will become happier. A nice staff room will also keep help staff regain energy faster. 
Staff room unlocked. Rooms. Staff room. The minimum is three by two. But I want a lot of staff, so let's do one more. Burp. Put the door over here. And then we'll give them a sofa. Okay. Um, so I can make people take breaks? Why do I want to do that? Um, okay, so let's put a bin here and let's put wait. Ah, uh, kitty. I'm very confused now. Oh, it can unlock things? Oh, okay. So we're unlocking things over time. Drawings. I feel like I fucked that up then if I didn't do the thing. If I didn't put the stuff in the room that it gave me because I don't have access to that stuff. I don't have access to any of like, these cool things. Smashing day for a bit of gardening. I mean, who doesn't like gardening? Digging up a bit of soil, sticking your hands in a bit of manure. Oh, what is this radio station? No, oh, wait, the sewage pipes burst again. <laughs> no, my mistake. Anyway, Here's the keep those toilet. green. Hmm. I feel like I have to probably build a bathroom. Okay, toilets. Toilet is a room. A toilet cubicle. What? They found a glass eye. Why can't I? This is all I get for now. So can I... Stop! I don't want all the pop-ups. Nope. Yes. Alright, back to building the room. General diagnosis. Must be at least a 3x3. Three three. We'll make it a little bit bigger. Like I said, we'll put the door over here. An easy scan machine. windows in here. Hospital level has increased. Yay! It's a peculiar new illness in town. It's the corona. Lightheadedness. For, oh, lightheadedness is the is the disease. Alright, whatever. Whatever. We're going to need some expensive new equipment to deal with this. Continue expanding the hospital to unlock the treatment room. We may also need some another GP's office and some more staff to keep on top of things. Yeah, staff, don't be staring at weirdos and their illnesses. Alright, I admit, I think I made the original GP's office too big. Uh... Put this here, and we'll give him a filing cabinet of hair, and we'll give him a bin. Uh, okay, never mind. Well, I guess I need to hire another person. Another yeah, doctor. You, doctor, work here. And I need to hire a nurse. You, nurse, you can work here. 
unlock the deluxe. Oh wait, what is all this? A new endless misery. Misery guts. Chronic grumpiness due to a nihilistic semicolon. Gross. Georgina Shaker is ready for a promotion from student nurse to junior nurse. Promotion from student nurse to junior nurse will give her all these extra benefits. We'll give her a uh, offer a pay raise to keep staff happy. Oh my gosh. So what's the minimum happy? <laughs> all right. New illness, clamp. Bed face? These are weird illnesses. I don't like these. Quite alarming contortion to the face. Need a ward. All right, let's build some rooms. Let's build a ward. It needs to be a four by three. Invalid or invalid corner location? What? Okay. Uh, we'll give him a desk over here. That looks weird, but that's okay. We'll put that there. We'll put this here. All right, good to go. Ward is ready. Uh huh. Get a hospital level four. Hmm. A nurse is needed in ward. Where's my other nurse? Is that her? Yeah, that's her. Nurse Georgina Shaker. Alright, can I put items in here now? <laughs> no, I can't unlock any of these. So what's the purpose? A laxative drink machine? That sounds terrible. Yeah, you know what? Let's unlock this. I'll put it in here. Yeah! Make people happy with that shit. What the fuck? Awards and yearly review. Awards countdown. Four, three, two, one! All right, what did I get? Doctor of the Year. $5,000 reward. And we've also gotten Nurse of the Year. Another $5,000 reward. Fantastic. Oh, lovely. And now we've gotten the what? Oh, I don't know what that was. All right, another row award. The award assistant of the year. What? All right, stop doing the bullshit ones. Just give me the real ones. There we go. Another five thousand dollars. Just open all of them. There we go. No deaths. Yay! Cool. Mm. Interesting. Profit and loss trends. Oof. Alright. So our revenue is... $10,000 a month. Or wait. I guess. I don't really, I can't really tell what that is. Staff status. Room prestige is low. So I guess I need to add shit to the rooms. Happiness, health, policy. Diagnosis threshold for treatment. Fast track treatment decision. Staff training messages. All right, let's get this hospital leveled up. Can I edit? Can I move this door? Uh, 
edit. Okay, but I want to move the door. Okay, move the door. There we go. And then we're gonna expand the room. Okay. Uh, there we go. Alright, so that's good. Uh, this looks really big. Revenue, 30,000. Profit loss, not bad. Hmm. Why is this not leveling up? Alright, so we're going to make this bigger. Oh! Alright, so I want to put a sofa in here. An armchair. This music is killer. So good. All right. Um, I guess we'll put a plant. Make it look pretty. make people happy. Interesting. But plants have so much stuff they deal with. Alright. All right. Nope, that's in the way. Alright. Put this over here. Wow. So fancy. If you want to experience all that the pointy mountains have to offer, stay at the Underlook Hotel. Let's get some honks up in here. Honk honk honk. Honk honk honk. Kudosh. Deluxe clinic required. Alright, I guess I need a deluxe clinic. There we go. A deluxe clinic. Oh, this thing's huge. Put a plant in here just for happiness. Just for happiness. No, I don't want to cancel the room. Oh, okay. Complete room. Uh, edit. Ah, uh, fuck off. I move the door first. Edit. Move the door. Expand the room. What? There we go. Uh, items. A toilet cubicle. A sink, because people should be washing their hands. This is a fucking hospital. Dry that shit too. Walk around with your dirty, wet ass hands. Gross. I'll put a bin here. And you know what? Shits and giggles. Whoops. One more toilet. Haha. <laughs> Shits. You know what? We'll make it two. I'm spending all the money. All the money! 
All right, cool. Now we got a deluxe bathroom. Cure three patients with lightheadedness. I have no control over that. People with lightheadedness, please come into the hospital. Great, thanks. Uh, we'll put this plant here for happiness. That's what I assume is happiness. Ugh. Move plant. Sym symmetry. A very snuggly kitty on my lap. Me, me, me. <clears throat> Why is nobody in this room? They made me build this room and nobody's here. These people are tweaking the fuck out, man. I hope we're making money with all this stuff I've bought. We need to hire more nurses? Let's see. Let's hire another janitor. What is this? What? Ghost capture? You're hired, man. I went to a holistics nature commune last week to see what they could do about my gravy allergy. They recommended a long stay at their spa and a bottle of rosemary extract. It cost me a month's wages, but I'm finally starting to feel the effects. Still can't eat gravy, though. I don't want to replace Millie Bobby Brown. Whatever her name is. Let's hire another nurse. Oh. Dear hospital administrator, one-star hospital. Congratulations, your hospital is awarded a one-star rating. That's one out of a possible three. By the Two Point Health Ministry, I have retrieved your file from my bin to celebrate. Continue to develop your enterprise in Hogsport for further esteem and trinkets. If you believe that you're capable of more alternatively, run before you can walk and begin to expand your organization by opening a new hospital in Lower Bollocks. The choice, as they say, is yours. I, kudosh. What are you talking about my kudosh? No, I don't want to do that yet. Okay. So let's get another doctor up in here. Cool. Cure 25 Asians. Earn $200,000. I mean, we're making some fucking money. Can we do anything else with these? No. Okay. Um, items. Let's make like a waiting room almost. Burp. Burp. Don't forget the bins. We didn't have any bins. Silly me. Can't just give them food and no bins. Might have too many doctors. Well, I guess I better fix that shit, don't I? Do you have lightheadedness? Oh, it's literally a light bulb. What the fuck? Hmm. Increases chaos? That sounds fun. <laughs> Decreases temperature. Is temperature an issue? Okay. Um, let's put... Let's make this room smaller. Edit. Uh, can I make this one smaller? Okay, and then... Hmm. Okay. 
Alright, uh... Move the door over here. Delete this, delete this. Alright, fantastic. And now... We're going to create another general practitioner's room. <sighs> Fuck off. In today's headlines, lottery winner Arthur Compass has announced winning the jackpot hasn't changed him one bit. He made this announcement floating over Krogenbusch in his new gold-plated hovercraft, just like he's always done. Oh, I need to build another ward. So let's build another ward. Over here. Mr. McNally, and I'm going for the treatment. Uh, yes, we'll cure the patients from Bogworth. in the pharmacy? Are you kidding me? Um, Alright, let's get another one of these in here. Another drug mixer. Oh. Uh oh, here comes the awards and yearly reviews coming up soon. Alright, now it's time for the awards, I think. No? Did I cancel them? I think I canceled the awards. Oops. I got people getting angry. Today's nice words of the day. Hmm. Remember that you are strong and blessed, that to live is to learn, and that all bad things happen for a reason, while good ones come to glory. <coughs> That's a lot of nice words, Megan. Okay. Can I build? Doctor's GP's office. Oh, yeah, that's a weird one. Hey, 
Hey, we're making big money now. Really? You gotta hire more nurses again? Hmm. Alright. Mm, let's hire one more doctor. And you know what? For the hell of it, let's hire another janitor. I guess I can do another reception, huh? Interesting. Alright. So we'll do another reception here. And then we will go and hire another assistant. Ah, what is this? I am now a two star hospital. Fantastic. Let's put some more plants. Because who doesn't need more plants? Am I right? Perfect. So much happiness. Let's put some plants in the uh, this area over here. Wow. Fantastic. Oh, wait. Didn't put any other plants. Great. People should be happy now. What's in this room? What else can I put in this room? I guess I can up the prestige a little bit. I should probably put more fire extinguishers in case there's somehow a fire. Yeah, I guess that would make sense. And here. Mm, here. Cool. Um. Trouble making ends meet. Not really. Need some extra weighing time. scales. Yeah, let's do that. Smell my cat. Because an eighty percent interest repayment rate is nothing to sniff at. Smell my cat. Desperate solution. Can you put these? Oh, put there. This is two point radio. We'll put a weighing scale over here next to the fire extinguisher. Or one. Nah. Hand sanitizer. Yeah. This is some kind of pandemic, right? Am I really low on doctors? Alright, let's hire another doctor. This one. Oh my gosh, that janitor is actually finding ghosts. That's ridiculous. I already got one of those, so. Oh. Weird. I can haunt my own hospital by killing people. Guess I should be better at that. What else can I unlock? Her outgoings. What's our expenses? We're losing money. We're hever hemorrhaging money.
Hmm. Do I need to train people? Everybody's doing okay. What does training mean? Hmm. But I think everything looks good, so we should be fine. <coughs> Alright, health inspector. Come check it out. Here, we're making money again. Just a little bit. Interesting. Doctor required in GP's office. Woohoo! What's up? Oh, hi. Where you been? Let's see. We need more benches for people. Benches. All right, people. They're all going to complain about being tired of standing. Resubscribe. Ooh. Ooh. No, I'm not. Should I be? Why are you asking me if I am drunk? Am I broken? My toe's broken. Why? No. Why? Why is why would that have to be a thing? Because of my stream title. Interesting. Interesting. <coughs> yeah. Coronavirus made me do it. All these people and their lack of health, so I decided to buy a hospital and I'm Curing the world one patient at a time. That person has a light bulb head. They have light head in there. Why are you licking me? Why all capitals? Because it's a pandemic? I believe Marcus and uh, James Wilver, Wilvoral, Weirville. The third are watching. You're listening to Nigel Bickleworth. Nigel Bickleworth. On a two point radio. Lightheadedness emergency. To your favorite radio station. Vastly overqualified, Sir Nigel Bickleworth. This radio station is terrible. To entertain and to bring some small measure of sophistication <coughs> to your drab little lives. Should any of you have any requests for popular tunes? As I well, you didn't like that I had a them, do not have question in there? That I, have no intention I don't think coronavirus was a single word, word. Fine. Well, fine then. 
maybe <laughs> maybe it has to do with alcohol, which would make sense that you'd think I was drunk because the coronavirus. Corona's nasty. Bleh. Bleh. Don't drink Corona. Even if people are like, oh, I'm not. Oh, I didn't realize I did that. Hmm. I've been typing up typos all day. <coughs> I accept this challenge. Okay, we got a clean hospital. Sweet. Why am I typing? Mm -hmm. I have a computer mobile device in my pocket at all times. I do is type. Type, 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 type. Are there four people queued up? Six people queued up for this room? I guess I need to build another one. Um, That is a ward. So we're going to put a ward. Are there what? Kiki, stop. She keeps licking my hand and stuff. Weirdo. Lick yourself, not me. That's really close to the nurse's station. No, actually, I need to get back to my uh, adventuring. RPG adventure. Let's see, who else is waiting? Oh my gosh, we've got way too many people with light bulb syndrome. Gonna move this hand sanitizer over here. All right, there we go. <coughs> And then I need a deluxe clinic. Has anyone seen my pen? Oh, it's not going to let me do it because the door's in the way. Pause. Kiki, stop licking me. Don't be grumpy. You're the one who's licking me. I cut all the kitty's nails last night. All of them. Even the big one. It was interesting because I had to literally sit on my cats. To uh, lick the cat. Hmm. Sounds like a violation of uh, personal space for my cat. Uh, Deluxe Clinic. Alright, can I now build it? Can we build it? Yes, we can. Pop the builder. What? Oh, yeah, sure. Sell the items. Unpause. We shall cure lightheadedness. I guarantee it. We might have too many janitors. Several are currently idle. Well, one of them hunts ghosts, so I'm not firing my janitors. I refuse. God. You're terrible assistant. Yeah, I have a janitor that fights ghosts. So if a patient dies, um... They could haunt the hospital. And if you don't have a janitor that hunts ghosts, then they haunt your patients. I've already seen a couple get uh, ghost busted. Award ceremony! Alright, so we got the Doctor of the Year Award, Nurse of the Year Award, Assistant of the Year Award, Patient's Choice Award, Most Prestigious Hospital Award... And Employer of the Year Award, but we did not get the uh, No Deaths Award, and we did not get the Janitor of the Year Award. All my janitors suck, apparently, even the ones that can hunt ghosts. You fucking kidding me? Um, let's see. 
hospital value has to go up to 750,000 to get to three stars. So three stars is the maximum rank you can get on your hospital. Oh, really? I failed? Hmm. A patient has refused to pay $6,000 for treatment of bed face. Then tell them to get out of their fucking bed or pay their fees for bed face. Merp. You shouldn't have bed face to begin with, people. Hmm. How's my overview looking? Alright, we're making money. I oh, know, I get bed face all the time. I got bed face. I am not your cleaning pedestal. What are we doing? What are we doing? Tell me. Have a kiss? Give me a kiss. Sick people with more sense than money. Fortunately, I have equal amounts of sense and money. No, she's cleaning herself. She's not cleaning me. She's just licking her her paws and her face and everything all over me. See, you can do it right there. There's no difference. All right, I guess I'll lower my prices because people are pissy at me for it. Um, staff promotion. A promote, a promote, a promotion. What do I put over here? <coughs> hmm. Is there a room that I can put over there? Let's see. Give me another staff room. I did reduce prices, you ass. Hmm. Nope, I can't even put it there because there's a door over there. So never mind. Maybe I'll expand the bathroom. Uh... Edit, expand, expand. Um, expand, move door, door. All right. There we go. We've got a deluxe bathroom. Maybe I should increase the sinks. Hmm, yeah. Not enough sinks. People are not hygienic in this hospital. Uh, we'll get another hand dryer. These people need to wash their fucking hands. You filthy animals. Fucking gross. Throw your shit away. Uh, what else do we need? What? Listen, I've been washing my hands nonstop. We've had strep in the house. We've had flu in the house. I've got kids who are coughing all over everything all the time. And I ordered a pizza for dinner. And Jessica walked up with Odin and she opened the box. And she goes, look at this delicious pizza. And he sneezed on it. Now everybody's going to get the flu. I washed the pizza. Take a look at the new Ridiculous. dining establishment. <laughs> the, he sneezed on pizza! Throw him away! The scrambled emu eggs on pickled toast are particularly good. I give it four salt shakers. That kid can chow on pizza though. He had two whole slices and was just like nomin. And I was like, yep, that's my kid. I know. The health inspector's coming. And it's supposed to, like, he's supposed to look at stuff. <coughs> Excuse me. And tell me if, like, we get awards if uh, the hospital's clean and stuff. But I don't know if the cop, like, I don't know if the hospital's dirty. What the hell? 
Um, what the hell? <laughs> oh, go to bed soon. I'm tired. I don't know why. I took a nap today, and I drank a whole big ass coffee. Ooh, ooh. Yes, peasants. Be excited by my. That's alright. I figured. I was like, she got better things to do than watch silly old me. Fucking ice sculpture in the hospital. You know what? Let's cover this shit with ice with ice sculptures. Because we are cool. I think those are, that's what that is. Those are like little cool spots. Ooh, that shit's hot. Is it broken? There. Oh yeah, okay, cool. Look at that. We are the coolest hospital. We've got ice sculptures. Peasants worship my ice sculptures. Why does that person have heartbreak? Did you know patients and staff become hungry over time? Oh my gosh, these people are so needy. Can I unlock a new snack machine? No, I don't have enough kudos. That's what I call them. They're not called kudos, but I'm going to call them kudos. It's like these people have illnesses or something that need to be cured. Ridiculous. I know. I don't ever remember that being the case whenever I would get into the hospital. And trust me, I spent a lot of times in hospitals. My mom used to go to the hospital like every single week. Living in California, uh, Kaiser Permanente, I probably shouldn't even say the name of the hospital, is like the main hospital where we lived. And, uh,. It's just like, we were there all the time. And what I remembered about that hospital is no matter where you went in the hospital, this is like early 2000s, uh, the first Shrek was always playing. Always playing. I almost hate that movie just because I just feel like I always watched it. Thanks a lot, hospitals, ruining movies for me. Everybody's all about the Shrek right now, and I'm like, yeah, whatever. Overrated. Let's see, what else can I lively up this place with? Let's get some fancy backless benches in here. Yeah, oops. Oh, I didn't mean to put it there, lady. Get up. As to what she was reporting on, I no, can't say. Sure. Nobody tells me anything. Let's put it up here. Burp. Right, I'm not going to lie. This music is pretty intense. And it's pretty interesting. I don't have that's that's a career goal. I got janitors who water plants for me. Nice. Nice. You know what? Let's give him a little raise bump. Make him happy. Where's that smiley face? There we go. I guess my first 7 out of 7, too. I don't think I've cured 7 out of 7 this whole time. Yes! Congratulations! Your hospital has been awarded a 3-star rating by the 2-point health ministry. <coughs> I hope for your sake that you remember how you were able to concoct... Ha! Ah, cocked. Such a model institution, because the county will expect you to repeat this feat. Ad infinitum. May this free you of gumption and fill you with nerves. Yours fragrantly, Tarquin Foxbridge, Health Minister. Okay. Hey, 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 don't step on my controller. Attention. Please well, now I... Hmm. Hmm. 
Well, now I feel like I need to go on to the next hospital. Kiki, you're sitting on my controller. But. And if you happen to be in Lower Bullocks this morning, watch out for the gathering of druids down in Crog Bend's room. Why is this person sound like he's doing a really bad Garfield impression? The town will also pay host to a psychology convention. Hey, John. You got any lasagna? I think I'm going to save the next hospital for the next stream. And do like one hospital per stream. It's a pretty fun game though. Um, I haven't found any quirks yet. I'm sure it gets harder. Get to the next one and look. I built. I've got building the value. My two point foundation is valued at almost a million dollars. I started at two hundred thousand dollars. Got all this money. I got this money burned all in my pocket, girl. Um. Yeah, so I'll stream again, and I'll open a second hospital, and we can explore that hospital then. So my next stream will be... Uh, most likely Wednesday. Definitely stream it again next Saturday. Um, Wednesday is a good possibility. And if I'm up to it, I will also stream Thursday. So Wednesday, Thursday, Saturday is the plan this week. And I got to start working on some channel art. And I got to start working on some sub art. And what else am I supposed to be working on? Channel points. Channel points. That's a good one. I would love to do my channel points. And then I... I have one other thing I was going to... Oh, 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 I need to change my notifications on Streamlabs. I still have the generic zombie notification, and I want to do... Um, I'm going to do my goose head, most likely, and a honk. So I need to go find some uh, sound bites of my... Um, of uh, a honk. Yonk. Generic. It is generic. It like comes with Streamlabs. It's like a zombie. Let me see. I'll do it. Where is it? Um, will that play on the screen? You hosted the stream. Woo. Use my words. Um, let's see. Alert box. Here we go. Okay, so that's just a thingy. That's just a banner. That is also a banner. That's a banner. And that's a banner. I don't think my alert box is working. So that's another thing I gotta fix. Bruce. Bruce Banner. I am the Batman. I am the hero that Gotham needs. What? Trim my beard up real nice. Looks real nice. Trim my beard, shave my head. Pet my cat. Faded. 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 Alright. Thanks for watching. Alright. Night!